Hello everyone, welcome to the top percentile. My name is Vidhan Agrawal. I have scored 99.99 percentile in CG 2020. And today we have Arun Joy Dutt with us. He had scored 99.96 percentile in CG 2022, right now in JBMS. And uh, Arun Joy, I would really congratulate you for that score, firstly. And I would even Thank want you, so. you to, you know, introduce yourself to our viewers so that they have a slight idea about you. Uh, so, hi guys. Uh, my name is Arun Dutt. Uh, I have completed my graduation from VJDI in Mumbai in 2022. And post that, I joined Deloitte Consulting for four months and then took CET exam and got a 99.96 percentile to get into GPMs now. Hi, hi. Both of us are VJDI boys. So, we'll be looking at this question today where we'll be discussing the plan for next 30 days. I enjoy it be knowing that the tentative dates are 18th and 19th March. And, you know, when I was preparing, I did not have this clarity as to what should I do for the next 30 days, how many mocks should I take, if I should go for theory or mocks, ya pe videos dekhu, YouTube pe kiske videos dekhu. So there was a lot of confusion. So we thought, why not ask the recent toppers on what their strategy was for the last 30 days and what do they suggest to our aspirants? So if you could help us over here. So, uh, there are two set of people. First is the one those who have completed the portion. If you are confident enough that the portion is done, you can directly proceed on to mocks. Uh, if you, and already if you have taken up mocks and it's, it's not your first mock, you can try and strategize your mocks based on your strengths and weaknesses. Categorize it, work towards your weaknesses, improve accuracy in weakness, and uh, make sure that you don't lose your strengths while doing so. And uh, those who have those who are starting right now, their main focus is to clear the basics as well as start giving mocks side by side simultaneously. Because uh, for thirty days you need to uh, make sure that you complete the uh, basic rough portion in about ten to twelve days, and the remaining fifteen to uh, twenty days can be left for mock giving and different trying out different strategies. So there are uh, three to four scores ranges where you can apply these strategies. For example, someone who is scoring between uh, 80 to 100 marks in mock right now can probably increase their speed and try to see if he's attempting all those, solving all those 200 questions in the de de defined time. Because it happens that if you're scoring 100, maybe you're not even seeing the remaining last 45, 45 questions. And that can... It may happen that you are missing out on easy questions, which you could score rather than spending time in the first 150 questions on top of ones. It can, first of all, increase the score. The 80 to 100 bracket may now increase to 100, 120. And those who are in 100 to 120 bracket, uh, they need to understand where are they losing the marks if they have, if they are attempting all those 200 questions. Now, in this, they need to use uh, tips and tricks in order to solve those questions faster. If they are uh, solving those 200 and not able to score more than 120. And this is where uh, TTP, the top percentile videos, help me. Because uh, they have they do post multiple shortcuts and tricks, which needs to be, which we have used. And it is effective. It helps us reduce the time. So this, and now if you're in 120 to 140 bracket, uh, this is a tough phase because every mark counts. And what happens is you are able to score your questions in strengths, the, the questions which are your strengths. In suppose, for example, you're scoring eight questions in six minutes. But instead of, if you can do those eight questions in four minutes, that's what you have, you have to work for. And this is where the shortcuts and tips and tricks will help you. And the areas which are your weakness, you need to ensure that you are not uh, losing out on accuracy in it. See to it that all those all those weak, weak questions which you are answering are you are not um, reducing the reducing the time and improving the accuracy. Perfect. I would say. So two sets of people: those who haven't started the preparation and those who have started. Or maybe those who have done. So those who have okay. already completed, they can straight away go for mocks. And we had suggested that they can go for a mock daily. So for 30, 30 plans, they can daily give a mock and probably sit for two and a half hours at a stretch, take a break, 
go for go out for a walk and come back and do the analysis see where they went wrong and probably in, in the same day try and improve the those questions which they missed out or which they did not do correct got it and sure next day those questions are correct which they learned earlier right so scan उसी दिन मॉक दो उसी दिन एनालाइज करो एंड एनालाइज करने के टाइम यू अंडरस्टैंड विच ऑल टॉपिक्स यू आर नॉट गुड विथ यू इम्प्रूव दो टॉपिक्स ऑन दैट डे इट सेल्फ एंड द नेक्स्ट डे वेन यू गिव अनदर मॉक यू डोंट कम इट द सेम मिस्टेक सो दैट्स स्ट्रेटेजी फॉर पीपल हुई कम्प्लीट दर पोर्शन बट दो हैवेंट गिव टेन फिफ्टीन डेज टू प्रिपेयर गेट डन विथ ऑल द टॉपिक्स ऑल द चैप्टर्स एंड देन यू स्टार्ट टेकिंग मॉक्स डेली and the same strategy that is taking one mock daily analyzing it and getting done with your weaknesses all right so this is will help in improving the score perfect perfect and those who have started giving mocks for their strengths they need to find even better methods so that they can reduce their time agar um 30 seconds mein ho raha hai to you probably need to get another trick jo aap logo 15 20 seconds mein karke de of course it's not possible for each and every question but you got to look for it and that's where as arunja suggested ttp comes because we had provided the exact shortcuts exact tricks which we had used during our preparation and it worked for us and yeah that's what it is and for weaknesses you don't leave any chapters you go for the basics because tough chapters mein easy questions aate during ct and you don't want to lose out on those easy questions am i right correct even in the weakness also what happens is you are you are thinking that it's your weakness but what if the question is very easy and it may happen that the weakness part will be your strength during the exam you will see that all i have scored is with my weakness weak weaker sections so it okay. may happen you should be prepared for it as well perfect perfect thank you so much for that arinjo i'm sure students would really like that answer and would eventually go on that path thank you definitely thanks